All right, hello and welcome to all my lords and ladies out there in this wonderful kingdom. I'm Lady Emerald and we are continuing with Dragon Quest XI, Echoes of an Elusive Age. Um, like I said in the last video, they did release the defini Definitive Edition. I would like to get that soon because you can transfer your save over to that new game. And I would love to be able to show that to you guys. Um, I think like, like the graphics like look better. There's like 10 more hours of content. Like, it's one of those stuff I can't quite remember. I know last episode was a drunk episode. Um, if that was not evidently clear, this one is also a drunk episode. You're welcome. I did not want to stop recording, but for video, like I physically needed to stop recording like last episode. Um, and then I was like, I really want to just like keep recording, so here I am, making another video while I'm <laughs> drunk. <laughs> Even drunker than I was at the beginning of the last episode. You're welcome. I hope you enjoyed all my beautiful accents. Don't, don't be hateful towards me. Don't be hateful that you're just not as good as me. I understand. I get it. I get it. Hey, this is the couple. This is the couple that love each other. I'm not gonna read that because I already read it. Pretty sure. Oh, they're so cute. Cause like, remember when we like we first talked to them at night, and they were like all like lovey dovey, and then we saw him during the daytime, and he was like, I just really like this girl, and I'm not sure what to do next. I don't want her to feel like I'm just too much. So cute, bro. So cute. This little lady, what's up, girl? What's up, girl? I heard that the fugitives were trying to find a way to sneak out of town. If I were you, I wouldn't go wandering around. You never know who you might bump into. <laughs> Girl, you never know. You are correct. Sorry. Also, I know where we're going just because. Um, words. Wow. I'm still eating cookies, by the way. I'm gonna grab one here. Um, because I'm Sherlock freaking Holmes. And also, I've played most of this game already. Uh, but last episode, there was a certain- <laughs> My cat's like, give me a cookie! No, girl, you're a kitty cat. You don't need no cookie. What the hell, girl? Come on now. Um, there was a shop that was closed. The only shop that was closed, so like piecing things together, like with deduction, this is where we need to go. Um, uh, I've also played the game, so this is where we need to go. I'm gonna go here. So. My cat's like, yo, give me a fucking cookie. Hey, <laughs> girl, what's up? Wow. Sorry, watch the trip. Nice place you got here. Welcome, welcome. Feel free to browse. You'll find we only stock the very finest wares. While you guys watch this, I'm gonna play with my cat because she's funny. That's good. Oi. Because I'm looking for something very special indeed. Happen to have any orbs in stock? Sorry, I'm I'm so sorry. This is probably super immersive, but my cat hardly ever like plays like this. But keep watching. Eric's not happy. What's this orb? Eric! Eric! Long time no see, old Yo, pal. <laughs> oh, jeez! <laughs> Eric! My, my brother! My compadre! My, my partner in crime! It's, oh, it's really you! Large as life and oh, fighting fit! I'm so... Oh. You have no shame, huh? Get your backstabbing hands off of me! <sighs> you always were full of it, Dirk. But this really so takes the cake. Come on now. Admit it. You sold me out and sold the orb so you could buy this place, didn't you? I mean... I never! I promise you, I never sold you out! I was worried sick about you. I only opened this place to try and help you. Aw, cute. 
Oh, yeah. And how does that work, exactly? How does you opening this place and lining your pockets while I rot in jail help me? I mean, I don't know. Look, no. I was never much of a thief, you know that. But it turns out I know how to sell stuff. I got a gift, even if I do say so myself. Yeah, that's like a Cockney accent, right? Like, that, that's what I said last episode. Right? It's like a Cockney accent. Yeah. <sighs> That's what I've been doing lately. When you got <laughs> nabbed, I spent months racking my brains for ways of busting you out. I couldn't stand the thought of you being in there. Oh, Dirk, stop it. Uh, stop, okay? In the end, I realized I'd have to give up the orb. I took it to the king, told him I found it somewhere, and pocketed the reward. Mm -hmm. Then I use the cash to open up the shop here and poured all my profit into bribing the guards up at the castle so they'd let you escape. Oh, let him escape. Okay. Hmm. Now that you mention it, I did think it was weird they never tossed my cell the whole time I was digging that hole. Mm-hmm. Hmm. Mhm. <laughs> period? Exactly. Always I was paying them to turn a blind eye, weren't Poor I? Turn a blind eye, won't I? <laughs> <laughs> also, I love his, like, moustache, <sighs> his eyebrows, love the slits, attractive. Okay, okay. I'm Cute sorry. Dirk. I'm sorry I doubted you, partner. Cute ice cubes, cute ice cubes. I'm still drinking those John Daly's that I talking about last episode. Iced tea, lemonade, vodka. Only a little bit of iced tea, though. I mean, only a little bit of lemonade, lots of iced tea, vodka, mint, lime, soak. That's the spirit! Eric, old pal, it's so good to have you back. But I need that orb. And now, we don't even know where it is. Oh, yes, we do. Oh, yes, we do. Right this way, gentlemen. I can't wait to edit the, this video and last videos. I am going to be so... What's the word? Not embarrassed because I don't give a fuck what anybody thinks about me because I do me and only me always. Maybe flustered is the right word? I don't know. I always laugh. I'm always like, damn, this girl crazy. <laughs> Third person, I'm crazy. Hello. Hello. Well, hello, Tom Dempster. You must be Eric when it's lucky enough to be married to Magnificent Dirk. He always <laughs> just told such an awful lot about you. What well, underestimates that you are quite the most lighthearted thinker, gentleman in all the world. Fascinating. It's an honor to meet such a rogue. I'm sorry, were you? One understands that you are quite the most light-fingered gentleman in all the realm. Fascinating. Dot dot dot. It's an honor to meet such a dot 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 rogue. Also, my cat, my other cat is going fucking bonkers right now. He's just like running back and forth like, Yo, it's like only 11 o'clock at night and I'm just gonna run back and forth like a madman. Girl, are you into Eric right now? The quote unquote air fingers light finger gentleman? Girl. 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 I mean, me too, but that's what I'm point. Hey, yo. Cat. Parker. Yo, dude. What's up? What's good? Hey. 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 That beat a freaking psycho, my man. I'm trying to record some content here. God. I'm important, Parker. <laughs> Where are we going? I don't know. I can't open it up. <laughs> cool. In here or upstairs? Not in here. Cool. Upstairs though. You guys. I know I like hinted at it a little bit. But we have not met my favorite character yet. 
and I can't wait to meet him. <gasps> Mini Metal! Like, I cannot express to you how excited I am to meet my favorite character. I am so excited. We're not really that far off. Um, you know, there's it is times because I'm not I don't record going. Go on, go down, go down. Um, just cause I'm not I'm I am I'm not recording every day. You know what I mean? Um, where the hell am I going? <laughs> What's happening? What's going on right now? <laughs> I'm so confused. Hold on, let me finish my thought. I'm really excited to meet him. We're not that far away. But I don't record every day, so it feels like it's farther. Um, but I'm so excited to meet him. I'm so excited. <clears throat> Party talk? What's going on? I. Head <sighs> outside. Okay. We're not gonna, we're not gonna talk to him here. This transition, though, I mean, come on. Yes, honey. Yes. Hey, yo. Calm the hell so, down. Where is it? After I handed over the orb, I made sure to keep my ears to the ground about where it ended up. I knew it was important to you, see? Well, a little bird tells me that Endrick and his men took it to the King's Barrow, and it's been under lock and key there ever yeah, since. That's right. I totally forgot where I was. The King's Barrow, huh? Mm -hmm. That's southeast. Same direction as Cobblestone. Which means we can kill two birds with one stone. You coming, Dirk? A little adventure for old time's sake? Sorry, no can do. I got a shop to run and I'm a married man these days. You're my man these days. Married? Wow, you really have changed. Well, you always said you wanted to settle down and maybe go good into business you, someday. I mean, I'm happy yeah, for you. Yeah, good for you because if you said you've always wanted to settle down and maybe go into business. I mean, good for you per for pursuing your dreams. I mean, like, come on now. Goals, am I right? We'd better get going. Take care, Dirk, and thanks for everything. I'm sorry, I need more chapstick, you guys. Like, I, uh, I'm not exaggerating when I say how mild, it's a mild addiction to chapstick. Mm. Okay, click though. Let's go. Let's do You it. too, old pal. Be lucky, eh? And don't you two go doing anything I wouldn't do. Well, what kind of things wouldn't you do, Dirk? I mean, like, come on, I need to know a baseline. Cause like, I do some funky stuff, bro. The south gate is crawling with guards. We won't be walking out that way. Let's go back out the way. And Hendrix's men are too uptight to take bribes. I guess we'll have to go the long way round. If we skirt round the hills to the south, we should be able to skirt approach the King's the Barrow from the other side. To the south, okay, south. We can drop into Cobblestone on the way. Okay. Cool. okay. Yeah. Watch sure yourselves out there, Abby's eh? okay. That's right. They don't call that forest round there the mangle grove for nothing. Mm, lovely. There's plenty. Sorry. <laughs> It'll take more than a few kids' stories to scare us off. And besides, it's the only way to get there. Mm. Yes, I got a horse. So now we just like leave. Is that what's up? Cause like I'm cool, just like going straight, straight, straight into it. You know what I mean? Hold on, let's talk to him real quick. The little bird tells me that Endrick and his men took the orb to the king's bar, and it's been on lock and key ever since. Don't envy the poor monks that little journey. You'll go around by Mangle Grove, get there. This place is a bit nasty as it sounds. Sand. Sounds. Sounds. Good golly. I need to watch like a British show or something to get more inept with accents. Will my cats please stop making 
troublesome noises that bother me. Chase, wait. <laughs> Fun fact about me, Miss the Lady Emerald. Um, I don't like noise. Like, at all. I don't like noises. I don't like hearing noises. I don't like hearing repetitive noises. I don't like when things are too loud. I hardly ever listen to music. Rarely I've listened to music because normally it's too loud. I don't like when things are too loud. I know, I'm weird. I'm an oddball. I understand. It's fine. I don't care. I don't care. It is what it is. It's what it is. Also, where am I trying to go? I'm trying to go to this. Whatever, let's leave. I don't care. Let's leave. Let's go. Let's go. Oh, where am I going? <laughs> I have no idea where I'm going anymore. <laughs> oh, I think we need to go back the way we came. I think that's what was like a disgust. I'm not sure. Also, every time I pass this puppy, cute puppy. Cute puppy. So, going back the way we came. I mean, I don't really need like medicinal herbs or anything. I got a ton of those. Armor, I mean, like, I'm good. I'm like Gucci, you know what I mean? I keep running into stuff and being like, this is the way. Like the Mandalorian, this is the way. This is the way. This is the way. This is the way. I'm tired. It's late and I'm tired. That was a little arrow, like what is that? Is that just the huh. <coughs> weird? Alright, let's go! Let's go! Let's talk to Ruby before we leave. I wanna talk to Ruby before we talk to you? <laughs> what a night! I would trade me job for anything, not in a million years. What's your job, dude? <gasps> is Roxy performing? I want to see Roxy perform. That guy looked like he was like all for Roxy. You know what I'm saying? Hey, yo, what's up? <coughs> okay, cool. Good night. These cute kids. So cute. Wow. Golly. <laughs> Good job, Bozoi. Good job, in it. Oh yeah, I see Roxy. I see you, girl. Come here. That guy's like, Ugh. yeah, we'll go on, love. Roxy, darling, you rock my world. No way does bed, Roxy. No, I'll never get tired of watching her do, do her stuff. No one me is, mate. Hi, Roxy. I'll watch you too. I mean, you're not really like moving too much, though, for my taste. Like, you're just kind of like, yeah, this way. That way, uh huh. Yep, this way. That way. Now, girl, get into it. Come on, girl. Hello, handsome. You new? Let me guess. You come from somewhere out in the sticks. It's yours truly. Strut a stuff, have ya? <laughs> That's so. Well, enjoy. I ain't short on fans, you know. Even the little nappers love me. There's this one in particular, but he ain't around here at the moment. Probably off the planet, how I didn't seek. And it's quite a character that one. Got all of these ideas all around the town, is say. Sitting a minute, it wakes and all the lace What's up? The cheeky little Torang. What Did I just read? What did I just read? I have no idea what was said or what was spoken. No idea. This dude is just like in it though he's just in it to win it he's like i love roxy i love you girl oh i don't think i went on this i don't think i went up this way hold on you guys i need to go up this way because i didn't go this way before i didn't i didn't see it because you know i'm drunk what can i say let's go booty, 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 booty. Get over 
there is what I want to know. Damn. Seriously, though, how do I get over there? <laughs> oh. <laughs> There's a rope right here. Wow, we. Oh boy. <laughs> Something special in it. Seed of agility, perfect. That'll be useful later. When I have people a part of my team. Oh, there we go. Oh, gee. I already talked to him. Wait, no, he had something new to say. I saw the word mango grow. Welcome to downtown Eviable. Grimy little secret to push folks over what they want to know about. He <laughs> went from around here. Well, if you ain't got reason to stick around, I won't bother. You what? Plan on going to Mango Grove? Quite strongly recommend you don't. But if you insist, it's due south of here. Thanks. Thanks, Gov. Bye, rats. Bye. Bye. <laughs> go downtown. Actually, we are downtown. No, we're. Where are we? Words. Vocabulary. It's hard. Wow, they went down all that flight of stairs for me. Any sign of them? No, nothing. Let's search the town again. Yeah. 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 Let's not go too far out of Look our at comfort all those zone. Lights. They're pretty keen to find us, huh? I mean, King Carnelian seemed like pretty adamant about hating the Luminary, which I don't understand. We better steer clear of Heliodor until the heat dies down. <sighs> Yeah, I guess so. All right, through the Mangle Grove and onto Cobblestone. Let's do this. <laughs> um, something else in it. Something else in it. Um, I don't know where I'm going. I assume? Is there a horse thing nearby? I mean, like... Um... Uh, which way is south? I literally don't know. I'm guessing this way, but like... Yeah, let's read this one. Leave me alone! Leave me alone! I don't want anything to do with you. Let's look down here first. So it looks like Mango Grove is the other way that's the sign said, but I just wanna like look over here and see like what's up, you know? It's good. Any shinies anywhere you know what I mean? You know what I'm saying? So that is a valuable. Usually valuable. Uh, there, this way. Oh my god, I have the brain of a peanut. What the hell, dude? I see a shiny over here though. Horse though, I need a station to call my horse though. What's this? What's this then? I saw a shiny oh. Like I saw a, a shiny somewhere, but then I saw the rope and I got distracted, but then I was like, hey, I know I saw a shiny somewhere. So like <gasps> there's one over there too! Wow, they're just everywhere. Go! Go, go, go. It'd be really funny as if like one of my neighbors knocked on my door and was like, hey yo. You can probably hit the button pressing, I'm sorry, I forgot to click on my I'll put it back on my here. I have much since my cat left me because she's a bitch. I love you can quick quickly just glide down like that. Feels like a firefighter. I always thought that having like a like one of those poles would be really fun. You can just like slide down. From like one floor to the next one. Cool. Uh, 
da 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 I'm focusing all my concentration on just finding where I need to go. <laughs> go away! Leave me alone! Oh! That was good over here. What are you hiding there? <laughs> no! You little... What are they called? I forget what those are called. Oh, those are bodkins. Where are the mushrooms called? Fung how? Fungal? Fungal. Ah! Fungal, what the f- It's fungal. Get it? Cause it's a- Yeah. Cool. Get him! Get him, get him, get him, get him, get him! They are notorious for like their breath and it puts people to sleep. The sweet breath. Don't you think? I will murder. <laughs> there is. Every time you see that little ghost, that means there's a chest nearby. A red eye? The hell, dude? I did not find this chest in the last in my last playthrough. I don't. I have no idea what this is, and I want to know what it is. So, give me this one. a precious stone that burns with a blood red glow. Ooh, ooh, cool, cool. Let's go. I have like 30 more minutes to go. This music though is popping. I have it linked in the description who wrote the music. So in case you're wondering. So I was thinking about that and I was like, hey, I should include like Sorry, my brain didn't work that well. Especially like this in this stage. <laughs> um, I was like, yeah, I should I should include I should include <laughs> like the information about those people because I at the at the start of the playthrough I was like, I don't actually know who created it. <laughs> so if you wanna know who did the music, who created it, directed it, blah 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 blah, um just look it down and down in the description below it shall tell you. Saber to Sleeping hibiscus. They're so cute. Okay, I don't want to kill any, but I just want to show you the combat because they're so cute. Like they're so cute. Look at them. Oh my god. Great saber cub. I don't want to kill the saber cub. You guys can't tell I love cats. Oh my god. I love you. Also the enemies that are in like the Dragon Quest series are always so cool. Like they did such a it's just such a pheno it's just such a phenomenal series. Like I would say that this like the Dragon Quest saga is better than like the Final Fantasy saga, and that's just like my opinion, but you can hate me if you want. I just like love the style, I love the artwork, I love the stories. Like, it's good, you know? Okay. I'm not ashamed of my opinion, okay? My opinion. Hello. Oh, yeah, I have a cookie! I have a cookie, you guys. 
I almost forgot. I have a cookie. It's good. Chocolate. There's a horse when I need it. Good golly. I don't remember this at all. <laughs> I'm not gonna lie, I don't, remember, I don't remember this at all. Like literally at all. Can't go that way, that's cool. Mysterious fog looks like an enemy. <laughs> I ain't go fight any enemies right now. Go. F I don't want to fight any enemies right now. Um, I'll do that off camera. It's the only thing I will do off camera. Um, unless you guys say otherwise. But yeah. I mean, if you want to see all the battling, all the like farming, I mean, let me know. But like, it's just gonna be that just just repeatedly and killing enemies over and over and over again just to get XP. Um, if you want to see that, I mean, you can let me know. But otherwise, I will not um, show it. Leave me alone! Go away! I don't want to fight you! Leave me alone! Yeah, those guys in Dragon Quest VIII were like the bane of my existence. They were so evil. I mean, not, I mean, yeah, evil. I mean, <laughs> obviously, all the bad guys are evil, but um, they did this dance that would cause you to like. They did this dance that I think caused you to be cursed or something. I can't quite remember. The Dragon Quest Eight. Oh, what I love and hold very dear to my heart. You know, the one I've consistently talked about. Yeah, that one. If you haven't played it, play it. Play it. Get up there. Get up there, boy! Hello. So we'll see, we'll see soon enough what like all this stuff is going to be used for, don't worry. Don't you worry, you're like, what's the cool top? What's the right for, man? What's the, what's what at, man? You'll see soon enough, don't worry. Call for britches. Get your, get your panties in my bundle. Come down, go. Whee! I see a shiny off in the distance. You guys, I am so happy to be gaming again. Like, I can't remember if I've already talked about it, but like, I created this channel, this YouTube channel to game again because, like, I wasn't gaming. Like, I haven't, like, before this, I hadn't gamed for, like, six months. And this is coming from someone who has game, gamed her whole life. And it just, it just feels really good to be able to do this again, you know what I mean? Can this cow talk? What the fuck? Moo! Let's see what kind of weather we can look forward to, Moo! Looks like clear skies around here all the way through tomorrow, but the day after tomorrow could go one way or the other. What a peculiar cow, it seems our bovine friends have a thing or two about to expect otherwise. That caught me really off guard. <laughs> I didn't expect that cow to talk. I don't know where I'm going, you guys. 
I don't know, let's just go this way. Crap, like this? You're, you're probably like this girl is wrong. Why am I even listening to her? Yeah, yeah I am so I'm fun. Wow, an empty chest? Bulloni. I call him McFluffin. And McCavers and uh, stupid stuff. Holy mother of fuck. What the fuck is that, dude? Just kidding. I know what it is, but it looks terrifying just seeing it off into the distance, bro. What the hell, dude? I love the scenery though. I now remember what we're doing and where we are. I love this. Hello? 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 Look at that! A campsite! Yeah. And just when we needed yeah. one. Still a fair way to cobblestone. Let's rest up for the night. Yeah, and get more chapstick on my lips. Yep, that's exactly what we need, chapstick. I still can't get over old Dirk. He didn't just go straight, married, shop in the best part of town. He went straighter than straight. I mean, just like that. I mean... Uh... We used Wait, to be on. thick as thieves. <laughs> Literally. we travel the world, always on the hunt for loot. Ah, uh, those were the days. Oh, I'm gonna be your new best bud. Uh, oh, speaking of which, you. I just thought of something we acquired back then that might come in handy. Oh, you got something on that tiny body of yours that looks like you don't have a backpack or a purse or a man bag or anything? Yeah, i It's I've in decided. your boot. I'm giving it to you. Is it in your boot? You'll love it. We Tell sure me. did when we got our hands on it. Is that fit in your boot? Behold, the fun size forge. Pop a few raw materials on top, bash them with the porter pounder, and bops your uncle. New, Bro, that I'm fit in not your boot? just talking steel swords and the like, wooden boomerangs, a natty new jerkin, you name it, this thing can make it. Eric, I'm still confused as to how that fit in your boot, bro. Sweating over a hot forge was never exactly my style. But I have a feeling you'll get more <laughs> use out of it than oh, I ever did. Oh, yeah, baby. You can't just go smashing stuff together willy-nilly, uh -huh. though. You'll need the recipe for the piece of equipment uh -huh. you want to make. Here's a little something to get you started. You should strike while the oh, iron's I hot. Emerald receives a tome entitled Forging Ahead with the Fun Size Forge, a Beginner's Guide. Emerald learns how to make a bronze sword. Emerald learns how to make a divine dagger. There are recipes hidden all over the place. It, treasure chests and bookshelves are always a good bet. Oh, Keep an eye out and you're sure to find some I beauties. I have been looking out, don't you worry, bruh. This is this is what I was talking about just like five minutes ago when I was up top that by like the waterfalls and I, and I opened up the chest and I was like, oh, what's cog top for? What's wake room for? Well, this is this is what it is, guys. This is it. Um, it has something similar in Dragon Quest Eight. It's called the Alchemy Pot, and you could make stuff and it had like the book and everything. You could like look up the recipes. Uh, this one's a little different. Obviously, I can use the internet to look up recipes and stuff, but um, we'll see how it goes. Here, let me give you some of the ingredients you need for those recipes I gave you. Maybe you could try forging yourself a weapon or something. Cool, let's do it. Let's do it. Let's do it. Do it. <laughs> Not gonna lie, my TV's really bright right now. It's like a 70 inch TV and it's really bright in my eyes. You can use the fun size forge to craft all kinds of equipment based on recipes that make use of the raw materials you collect in your adventures. <laughs> Air. 
New recipes can be found in treasure chests and on, and on bookshelves, and you'll be able to acquire the ingredients you need by defeating monsters or investigating sparkly spots. You mean the shinies? Yeah, that's what I thought. Go ahead and try to make your first masterpiece with this recipe Eric just gave you. Okay, let's do it. It's a fun size forge you can use to build brand new equipment or rework your existing kit. Cool, forge weapon. Woo! Um. Let's make this. Yeah. Let's do it. Let's do it. We have everything we need. Okay. This is a little tricky and it was a little confusing at first, but let's read it. Smithing items couldn't be simpler. Select bash to start beating your equipment into shape and finish when you're ready to wrap things up. Hammer away at each individual area with your porta pounder to fill up the blue gauge next to it and aim to get every god gauge. Hey guys, that's gauge. <laughs> and aim to get every gauge into the green zone. See the traveler's tips for more information. Okay, so bash. We're gonna bash this part. We're gonna do it one more time. We have to get to that green spot. One more time. Perfect. When we hit that little tick mark, that's gold. That means that's the best possible spot we can literally be in. So, now this one. Ooh, we got a critical. One more. Yes, honey. So not on the crit, well, not on the point part, but it's still in with it's still within the green so that means it's still going to be good finish yep i'm good this is, it. This is what i want this is what i want baby erica new dagger even though he's using the ranks cool i'm smart <coughs> yeah that was fun now let's do it again 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 yeah, I really like this um, this system of uh, the forge. I think it's really cool. You'll receive perfectionist pearls each time you successfully successfully forge a piece of equipment. You can use these attempt these to attempt to rework the item with the aim of doing an even better job. Don't worry about ruining your hard won works of art. Even if you fail to re rework something, you won't lose it. And if you succeed, you'll come away with something truly special. I'm drunk, you guys. I don't know if you can tell, but I am. Ah ha ha, it's so funny. Ah, ha, ha. Wait, hold on. Yeah. There's only one more, but like, there's like XP. Because each time you like make stuff during this, you get better at it. You know what I mean? So that's what we're gonna do. We're gonna bash. One more. Yeah, baby. That's good. And then... <coughs> One or two more? Yeah, it's good. Finish. Yeah. Oh, I forgot to show you. Hold on, let's see if we can make something else. I forgot to show you something. Success! That'll be for me. Yeah. That'll be for me, though. I'm not gonna keep reading this stuff, so you can pause it if you wanna read it. <coughs> Ready a lot, cool, cool. Ready a lot, cool. Um, because what? Okay, I forgot to show you something, but I'll show you it next time, I guess. Um. So when you bash an item, you know that, that that bash skill, it like, you know, goes up a certain amount. You'll get more different not abilities, but choices other than bash the more you time the more times you keep working at the forge. So you you'll get ones where you'll just inch forward the blue bar just a little bit to get, you know, it closer to say like that point to get that gold. Um, or just like other ones like there's like double hits and whatnot. Um but down at the left bottom, there's one called like, uh, it's like what your focus points are. And so you can't just endlessly do bashes. Like you just can't. And different like say quote unquote abilities cost different points. Um, 
So you just have to watch out for that. Next time we use the forge, we I will show you, but I have nothing else I can physically make. I don't want to waste items as well, so this is it. Yay! I'm not going to read this because I don't want to. Pause it if you want to read it. You're welcome. Pause. 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 I don't want to keep reading it, though. Open Adam Chimp, someone's high and square away, top for us to do some cobblestone. I have no idea what I'm using. Let's uh, equip some stuff. Yeah, cool. Let's equip this. What's this doggo doing? What you doing, bro? What's up? What's up, y'all doing? Sniff. Sniff. <laughs> is that what you mean? My nose is always, uh... <laughs> uh, stuffy. I don't know why. <laughs> I don't know why. Is the stuffy at work? No. Is the stuffy when I'm just, like, watching YouTube? No. Stuffy, whenever I record though. What's this? My grandma's hair is glowing. It seems to be responding to the curiosity. Curiously shaped plant. Hold your hand on to it. I didn't ever do an accent, but whatever. This is cool. What? Whoa. That's super cool though. Watch. Watch it. Chop, chop, chop. Chop around the clock. One, two, three, look out, trees. Oh, a woodcutter's life is the life for me. <laughs> what in the world? What in the world? So, what the hell? I repaired the bridge only yesterday. And now some blight has gone and destroyed it again. If I ever find out who did this, I swear I'll... You called? Tricky devil at your service! <laughs> I went to a lot of trouble to smash at this stupid bridge! I'm not about to let you fix it again! Here! <laughs> get a load of my devilishly tricky shapeshift beam! <laughs> Fuck you, Jim. <laughs> He's the dog we just talked to. He sniffed us, you guys. Now that's what I call tricky. One minute you're a silly old woodcutter, the next minute you're a smelly old dog. I'm a devilish genius. This game is so good, you guys. Now, what mischief shall I get up to next? Oh, so much it's trouble like to cause so little time. <laughs> the interest, the in. Kisses between people and characters is just. Uh, <laughs> Bye, doggy! Stay! Like, they didn't have to put this in here. <laughs> they did. <laughs> mm -hmm. Ooh. Ooh. Shiny! An empty treasure chest! I think I've just hit upon my most devilish trick Ooh, yet! Let's do it, bro! What we have next? What the heck just happened? You touched that plant and then I'm the luminary, I saw bro. All this crazy stuff. Oh. <coughs> How do I not cry right now? Also, don't judge me if I cry during this playthrough, okay? I'm an emotional being. You really I love... expect me to believe that yeah. this mutt here is actually the woodcutter? Huh. There's never a dull no, moment not. with you around. I'm a fantastic person. I'm gladder every day I broke you yeah, out of jail. Welcome. I'm a fantastic person. Well, welcome. all I know for sure is that we're never going to get out of this forest until we get that bridge fixed. You're right. You're right. You're right. And if what you're we right, just saw right. was true, Rover here is the only one who can fix it. Why don't we find that chest and have a word with our Oi, mischievous agree. friend? Oh, wait, agree. 
Let's head back the way we came and see if we missed it somewhere. Okay. All right. All right. Um. No. Also, imagine recording. Recording. <laughs> imagine recording the music for this game series. That's all I can say. Is like. So cool. Or like that beginning cutscene at the very beginning. That was awesome. Like, wow. Blown away. I uh <laughs> I played an instrument in high school, not to like brag or anything. I played the saxophone in high school, it was fun. And then I stopped because my art was more important. <laughs> you guys didn't know I'm an artist, bro. I'm an artist, artista. It was just for fun. I need to go to bed. I'm tired. <laughs> Ooh, is this the chest? I hope it's not because like... I have like four minutes left. I don't want to open it because I think it might be the chest that has the thing in it because obviously that's what it meant. I'm a quick save, bro. I find out a quick save. Auto save the mango girl? How do I auto save here? Oh, oh, that's right. That's right. I can save here. <laughs> oh yeah. <laughs> hey guys, what's up? Um, I don't know if you know. I'm so dumb. <laughs> Anyways, so next time we will open up the treasure chest and find that tricky little devil and try to get across the bridge to continue on towards Cobblestone and King's Barrow to get the red orb. So, anyways, I hope you guys enjoyed the video. If you liked the video, you can like and subscribe. Um, if you didn't like the video, what the heck, dude? Is there something wrong with you? I'm just kidding. No, if you didn't like it though, leave a comment, let me know. Um, I would love to hear what you guys think about it, so. Alright, cool. Alright, I'll see you on the next video! Ooh, my cat's going crazy right now! He's running back and forth and back and forth like he is some crazy madman! What's up, dude? What's up, bro? Calm down! Anyways, thanks for watching, guys. Thanks, Rover. I appreciate you. You are sniffing me. Alright. Bye guys, see you in the next video!